In this chapter you will learn how you can use the web server to query the diagnostics information easily and completely independent of location. Using the integrated web server you can diagnose the faults in your plant easily via a web browser on your PC or mobile device. Even more convenient is the Semantic S7 app. It allows you to connect to Siemens CPUs of the new generation via Wi-Fi or mobile data network. Comprehensive access to several stations is possible for diagnostics and control purposes. How about if, for example, you wanted to call up the status of a controller? All you need to do is activate the web server in the TIA portal. Now you can see the firmware and the serial numbers. Access the SD card, view the controller's LED status and use the controller's diagnostic function, including all components. This is also the case for all safety components, as well as for faults, right up to broken cables and short circuits. And there's no need to write even a single line of code. How exactly is that done in the TIA portal? Configure the properties of the web server in the controller's device view. Then activate the web server and assign the access rights, for example for performing diagnostics to the user. After you have loaded the change into the controller, you can access the controller via the web server using a standard browser. The home page now shows the current status of the controller. The topology page gives you an overview of the status of all Profinet devices in your plant. Clicking on a faulty device takes you directly to its module status. Detailed information about the fault is displayed here. The Messages webpage shows the current messages. The web server is integrated into the firmware of the controller. With the help of a web browser or the Sematic S7 app, CPU signals can be queried very easily and totally independent of location. This enables you to respond much more quickly at decisive moments.